is me, Cece, back again with, guess what? Another video. Fall is one of my favorite times of year. I love the chill in the air, I love the leaves, I love the food, and most of all, I love the fashion. It provides great opportunity for layering without having to wear like really intense puffer jackets, but it's also not like you're forced to just wear a t-shirt and jeans and then just run out the door because that's all that the temperature will allow you to do. I've put together a little lookbook for you guys of outfits that I personally am going to be wearing throughout the fall, and hopefully this provides you with some inspiration for outfits that you can wear throughout the fall as well. I tried to work something in here for every aesthetic, just so that you all have something to draw on as you are looking for fashion inspiration. So, without further ado, let's go. So this first outfit is definitely giving off witchy vibes. This one is pretty simple, it is a maxi skirt, a cropped sweater, and a pair of black boots. That is it. I historically have not been known to wear skirts very often, but I did just get this maxi skirt a little while back. And I just love wearing it in fall so much! You could also wear this maxi skirt with a tighter turtleneck or a long-sleeved shirt, or you could throw whatever kind of sweater that you want over it. You can also layer a pair of leggings or tights underneath it for when it gets really colder in late autumn. I think that it's a really great way to make an outfit a little bit more glamorous and femme, while still staying comfy and keeping your legs warm. This next outfit is a little bit more complicated, but you can still use pieces that you probably have in your wardrobe. This one is a short skirt with a fitted turtleneck on top, a pair of black boots, and an oversized denim jacket over it. For me, this outfit is definitely a little bit more femme, but dipping your toes ever so slightly into more edgy fashion. And I feel like this outfit is definitely designed for September, which means that it is a little late for when this video is being posted, but you could warm this outfit up if you threw on a pair of tights and a warmer puffer jacket on top, and wrap a scarf up there to keep your neck warm. This third outfit definitely dips way more into the very edgy emo scene sort of look, but I feel like us former edgy emo scene sort of kids just like thrive in fall. We love our flannels, we love our beanies, we love our socks, we love our Doc Martens, and this outfit has it all. I will admit that this outfit is basically just an edgier variation of the second outfit, in this lineup, but you could also totally make this outfit work with a pair of distressed black denim jeans in pretty much any cut if you wanted to make this a more masculine look. Now our fourth outfit switches gears and dips more into a preppier look. I feel like this outfit is giving me academic, a little more masculine, but on a casual day if that makes any sense. For this outfit, you're gonna need a button-down shirt, an oversized sweater, a pair of jeans in whatever cut you would like, I personally like a more straight leg or oversized jean, and a pair of white sneakers. Unfortunately, my camera was dying as I was getting the shots for this, so I didn't actually get a whole lot of clips in this outfit. But sucks to suck because this is the outfit that I'm filming the video in, and this is actually my favorite outfit in the entire lineup. This outfit perfectly walks the line between schoolboy and rebellious, masculine and feminine. It is the perfect fall outfit. Outfit. And please don't try and change my mind on that because nobody can change my mind on it. This is the perfect fall outfit and I am going to be wearing it all fall long. That being said, we do have one more outfit to cover. I know, how could you possibly top that last outfit? But this outfit is definitely a little bit more formal, like you're giving a presentation but in a casual workplace or academic sort of vibe. This outfit is a fitted turtleneck, a pair of jeans in whatever cut you would like, a blazer, and a pair of white sneakers. I like this outfit because I think that it can go in pretty much any circumstance, but as I'm starting to enter the workforce, I'm starting to have to wear more formal outfits, and this walks a nice line for me between not too formal, but still presentable. I would not recommend wearing ripped jeans with this outfit if you plan on wearing it to work though, and if you are planning on wearing this to work, you could easily switch out the jeans with a pair of khakis or a pair of pants that matches the blazer, and it would still be a very cute look. And that, everybody, is five outfits that I'm going to be wearing all this fall. If you're looking for more fashion inspiration, I have two lovely videos right here for you. And if you like the vibes you're getting from this channel, feel free to subscribe! I hope to see you in the next video, but until then, this is Cece signing out. Bye!